Hello everyone, I am Munir Jaman Akash. Welcome to our brand new Laravel series, Laravel REST API development with Laravel 9.x. Currently Laravel 9.2 is running, so we will cover Laravel 9.2. And who is eligible for, for this course? I will prefer for beginner to intermediate level developer can watch this course. So let's see what will be included in our project. First of all, documentation is very important. That's why we have added Swagger API documentation. Swagger is a very popular way to develop APIs. We'll use this. And for authentication, means user login login logout sign up that's why we have used jwt auth and for coding practices uh, we have used repository repository pattern and definitely with interfaces and other stuff and for coding practices i'll use psr12 coding standard and for testing our code i'll show a little with php unit so let's see what will be in our demo so this will be our final api project we'll use this Swagger API documentation. First of all, let's just uh, enter into the root URL. This will be our base documentation and read API doc. Someone can read actually a great looking API documentation. You can also search any APIs here. We have added authentication, login, register, and user profile getting, and product, product list, creating product all product some are publicly accessible and those are only accessible if you're logged in and edit delete that's that's all so anyone can log in with his credential and use the token this is the token with the token and in swagger there is a authorize authorize you can authorize and close and after authorization he can see other api so then he can see all products that's it but if he's not authorized that means he's just logged out let let's just lock out him and see what he will get an error authorization error unauthorized access that's cool you can also do this with postman no problem it's up to you and this will be our api project and finally after doing this in this series and I will, I will launch an another series also for implementing these APIs uh, for with Vue.js or React.js. Both I will implement those both also. So let's just start.